hello and welcome my name is Amul and you are watching tube mint in this video I'm going to show you how to add Google Adsense custom ad units to your WordPress websites so let's get started you can see first you will have to create your custom ads so simply go ahead and log into your Google Adsense account and then go to ads and then click this buy ad unit and then these are the frequently used ad type so most people create display ad so go ahead and create ad so basically click on this type in your name and depending on the requirement you can create your ad type here so i have created three types of ads square horizontal and vertical you'll have to type in your name and create this and get the code from here right so first I will have to type in the name select the type and copy the add unit code and here I have three add unit code that I'm going to show you how you can add it to your WordPress widgets so different section in different parts of the WordPress let's say you want to put it on sidebar uh, at the bottom in the footer so let's go ahead and see it or whether you want to put it somewhere else so if you just want to put it on somewhere on the sidebar like this or at the footer you don't need any plugin so let's see this is a vertical ad banner ad which is going to be like this so like this one so this is going to be in the sidebar okay so I'll just copy this code unit un um, yeah code for this unit ad and then I will vi visit my back and basically WordPress dashboard area go to appearance and then go to widget and this is the sidebar so to place this code here we will take another widget which is custom widget somewhere here in the sidebar and paste the code here you can type in the name but it's not mandatory so go ahead and save it and hit the done button and now if you go ahead and refresh this page you'll see your vertical ad will start appearing here on the right a sidebar at the very bottom you can replace it most probably people keep it here on the very top so what I'll do I'll simply drag it over onto the top and now it should appear on the very top okay so you can see this is how you can add your vertical AdSense add unit to your sidebar and this makes sense here on the right sidebar the second type of ad I have today is a square ad basically so it's a square in dimension I'll go ahead and put it somewhere on the footer so let's have a look at what we have at the footer section so I have these two banners which I have added manually so what I'm going to do I'm going to delete one of these probably this one so uh, this is uh, section one and yeah so this is what I'm going to delete and add this custom HTML thing it's a widget and make sure I have copied the square banner add unit code which was generated in Google Adsense and then save it done and now if I go ahead and refresh it it should be changed here at the bottom in a just a while okay so there are too many ads here okay these are auto ads you see here on the top on the bottom 
okay so these are auto ads hmm it just push or oh, pushed it up like this so this is a square ad I don't know why it's appearing like this and you see this is my other widget in the footer and then I have one more here and let me see why it's doing like that hmm this is a square this is horizontal looks like let me just switch the ad maybe I have wrongly it's a horizontal one but still let's try yeah it's still showing the same unit here so it takes time I'm pretty much sure this is my square ad that I created it is supposed to be like this on the uh, you see the upper part or the lower section on this this oh, this ad on the right so I'm gonna change it to the square ad unit uh, code here this is square ad you can see here and I'm going to leave this uh, Google to optimize my websites code and this is something that I want to put on let's say on every blog post okay so for that what I will use I can use plugins or I can use a custom method so method is going to be under function function.php and let's see so this is WP head and I have this loop start add content to the post top and then post end so basically I'm going to put it on the let's say uh, on the very bottom bottom is okay so single here this is where I'm going to put the code so hopefully you can see it this is the the way to put your ad on the very top so you simply have to paste your code here or if you want to put it on the bottom of every blog post you want to put here so I'm going to paste the code here and let's see how it goes so first thing first delete this one yeah everything should be in the double quotes here otherwise it will clash with this one so I'm gonna save it let's see if it saves perfectly saved okay on my website there are lots of ads here now I will fix this so now if I go ahead and refresh and go to blog page which is here hmm, close it and just view some of the blog post here it should appear here on the right time oh it's on the bottom I guess so ads may take a little longer to appear sometimes this ad is not working perfectly so what I will do I will replace the code in some time okay I'll go to add sorry blog and let's see sometimes if you put the code on a single blog post Google looks for a good content basically the mix content type so basically media type it could be images videos and obviously content so you need to have lots of content here okay so it will start showing up however this is how you add content sorry um, ads unit to custom ad units 
to your WordPress website. There are multiple plugins that you can use that gives you more uh, options. So let me quickly find one. And since just type here, or you can type add manager. Advanced ads manager and AdSense. So in past I have been using this one. Let's try this one. Hmm. This seems to be a heavy plugin. Uh, however, let me show you. This was just updated five days ago. This was added three days ago. Advanced ad. Okay. They are trying to sell this plugin, I guess. And create a first ad, second ad, third ad. So let's create the first ad. Image ad. Oh, it's 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 mess. So what I'm gonna do? I'm going to remove this plugin. Deactivate. Okay, I'll go ahead and search one of the similar AdSense. And this time I'm going to use this one here. I have been using this plugin in for some time. Recently I removed it. And here, this plugin gives you lots of options. So you go to settings and then go to where is it okay you can go to settings from here add inserter that's the name of the plugin and basically what do you do it gives you lots of good options so i have a vertical add horizontal okay so this is horizontal this is this is a vertical one it's wrongly named I guess oh this is the vertical one so I need this okay this is vertical on the right this is horizontal one this is horizontal one which I was planning to put on the single page so you just paste your code here and I may have lots of codes from other apps, uh, previous configuration so I'll remove them and here you can see I want to put it on the post posts like every post right and then before post after post you get a lot of options you simply choose one and you want to make sure it's in the center and then you save it and let's see where it goes uh, okay, here we go. So this is basically home page of my site. Okay, so there, there seems to be lots of ads here and this is why it's not showing up. But now you see it starts showing up here on the top. So this is going to work. In just some time as I told you Google makes sure that your site has good content only then it starts showing multiple ads wherever you want to display so what I will do I will remove this one good widgets this is not very optimized ad unit for this section so go to here and let's remove this one and I'll also show you how you can add a particular custom ad uh, image ad so go ahead and click on select and I already had one so here we are and then you can type in your custom URL here somebody clicks on it will be taken to a different page 
so I can go ahead and take a URL I'm, I'm not sure where it is so for the moment this is where you simply put your custom URL for this image add unit and add to widget you can type in your name let's say oops what happened you can link here as well so simply go ahead and type in your link your custom link your affiliate link whatever you want to I'm sorry guys sometimes it takes time to save this is an internet issue it seems to me uh, it could be something else too so I'm just going to refresh or oh, let's see check it it's longer video I don't want to take long time here. oh my gosh it's taking long time to load so I'm gonna see uh, reload this page and try one more time quickly hmm. anyway guys so this is how you add custom ad units from AdSense to your WordPress website and if you want to add completely custom your affiliate image ads banner ads so this is how you add your banner ads to your WordPress website make sure you just add your affiliate link here so if somebody clicks on it will be taken to the affiliate link or offer whatever you have to promote alrighty so that's it for this video guys thank you for watching please subscribe to my channel if you haven't bye for now